name is Aileen Pires and I'm an astrophysicist and this is which inner planet has the highest escape velocity. So first let's talk about what escape velocity is and how do things remain in orbit. So let's say here on Earth we have a really powerful cannon and this cannon shoots out this cannon going at a certain speed, right? For a while it's orbiting the Earth, right? It's moving around the Earth and then it comes to gravity and it goes to the ground, right? So for a while it was actually orbiting the, the planet and then gravity just took it down. So how do we make those like missiles go very long distances? We generally just increase the speed. So if it has higher speed, it's going to be able to like go further before it succumbs to gravity. So now how do we launch things into space? Now escape velocity is how fast do you have to go to escape that gravitational pull of the object. So how fast do we have to shoot this bullet in order for it to actually leave the gravitational pool of the Earth, so to go into outer space. So this escape velocity is described as the square root of 2 times the gravitational constant g, the mass of the planet, divided by the radius or the distance to where you want to go. So here on Earth, um, the gravitational, the, the escape velocity is about 25,000 miles per hour. And the reason we know um, this is because we can easily calculate this. So if we look at all the inner planets, um, the one that is more massive is the Earth. And as you can tell, the escape velocity depends on the mass. So most likely speaking, out of the inner planets, the one that's going to have the highest uh, you know, escape velocity is going to be the one with the highest mass, and that's Earth. And that's true, so we're going to calculate uh, the escape velocity. So the gravitational constant G is 6.67 times 10 to the minus 11 and the units are meter cubed, kilogram per second square. And I'm going to switch from the miles to uh, kilometers now. Uh, and then I have the mass of the Earth, which is 6 times 10 to the 24th kilograms. And then I have the radius of the Earth, so let's say to escape the surface, is 6.4 times 10 to the 6 meters. And this is going to be an approximation, as we're going to do it here on the board. And now if we plug it into our escape velocity, we have 2 times 6.67 times 10 to the minus 11 times 6 times 10 to the 24th uh, divided by 6.4 times 10 to the 6. When we calculate this, this gives us about 1,102 meters a second, which is about 11 kilo, uh, kilometers a second, and that's equal to 25,000 miles an hour. So that's about how you calculate the escape velocity of a planet. Now, out of the inner planets, because we have the highest mass, we have the highest escape velocity. My name is Eileen Perez, and I'm an astrophysicist, and this is which inner planet has the highest escape velocity.